the local paper. Tuneful nappies. That one's me. I had a nappy that play a tune every time I weed. My mum said, it doesn't stay in the same place in the nappy and either slips out or gets where it is uncomfortable. That's in the butt. So it was a small device that slipped into your butt? As far as I can gather. Who invented this? My mum said, I wouldn't dash out and buy one. I look happy. Of course you look happy. You got a singing butt. I was returning to Kettering, Northamptonshire, home of Weetabix, theme parks, and myself. After six years of absence, I had decided to revisit and reconnect with my hometown, remembering what made it such a unique place to grow up in. Between the ages of 11 and 17, I attended Montague School. It is now called Kettering Buclue Academy and looks like a completely different building, because it is. It might only be the fields out there that you actually recognise. Just the fields? <laughs> so we'll... Um, yeah. Or maybe the old caretaker's bungalow, you might recognise that, that's still there. We weren't allowed in the caretaker's bungalow. No. Mother. This is where the old school was, so obviously the, you can see the difference um, in the levels, the ground levels. So what they did was they raised the building to the ground and it formed the foundation, so they didn't actually have to take any of the old bricks away, it's, it's all there. My school that I went to... Is the bricks are all under there. The bricks are under the AstroTurf? Yeah. Yep. So that was, the, that was the main school there. I brought one of my old art projects along with me and decided to show it to some ex-teachers of mine. Then that's a time warp. My original plan was to glue clock faces on it as well, but right. it went out of time before the end of the project. Why is there a door at the There's end? There's an irony to that. The door, so you get into the building. It's the building. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. And you get in the... It's a building? Yes. I told you that in the car. I thought you were joking. No, it's a building and a time warp building. You go through time and you go in the building that way. Yeah, how'd you get to the door? Time travel. So but you need another one to time travel to get to the door so that you can get into that one? Um, no, you go in there and travel through time. How do you get in there? Through the door. This, this is our lovely AstroTurf. Well, this is where the school used to be. Yes. So, so the, I think the humanities and maths block that you were talking about, it was just, it was just here. Where and the you, goal is? Yeah, yes. It used to go run along here. This is really where your school was. This was my school. What makes of AstroTurf is this? It's, um, it's 3G, which is third generation, 3G. 3G, third generation, the latest one. So yeah, it's, it's made out of um, rubber crumb, which is like this material here, which is um, like tyres all crumbed down, old tyres that become crumb, and then false grass. So all weather pitch, you've heard of people sort of describe them sometimes as all weather pitches maybe? Yeah. yeah. Crumb. Yeah, rubber crumb. Rubber crumb. The word that springs to mind would be gangly. Yeah, that's, yeah. A bit yeah, gangly. Right. I remember more about your PE by talking to your dad at parents' evening than I did of you in action in PE. My dad? Yeah, because he used to come up to parents' evening and he'd sort of have this, like, grin on his face and say, like, you know, how's James doing in PE then? As if to say, yeah, he's a bit gangly boy. <laughs> <laughs> did I show you that performance that Joe did mm. in The Tempest? Mm. <gasps> I tell you, it was, it actually kind of brought me to tears a lot. Yeah, she could do yeah. everything. She could. Oh, same yeah, drama. She was, like she was fantastic. Don't, not gangly at all. 
Don't no, inflate. Oh, no. she's not gangly. Is that, she's not gangly at all. <laughs> Look, stumpy arms. Yeah, it's too coordinated to be gangly, I feel. Yeah. Do you great like example. This is that joke that you're speaking about. Uh, well, yeah. yeah. Of course. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, How could we forget? Yeah, yeah. To be honest, I'm a little bit embarrassed that she's here in the room. Yeah. Yeah. I couldn't really. You didn't know she was there. <laughs> no, yeah. it's just, it's just yeah. so lovely to see well, her. She is here. Don't we just know it? Door to the maths class. Put my art project down. I learned maths. <laughs> couldn't remember any of my old lessons, so I couldn't reenact it. Do you remember me playing drums in the school performances? Remind us which performance. I did. Oh, Jesus. It's coming back now, yeah. Yeah. Very concentrated. It doesn't look very uh, natural, does it? No. no. I do remember when you left sixth form, because you were in my form, weren't you? Just yeah, for I was in a your very form. short time. Yeah, from, yeah. I, I left halfway through sixth form. And didn't you try and make it as a, in a band, or was that...? Yeah? Yeah, that's... that's that was the plan, yeah. Yeah, yeah. What did you play? I played the drums. Yeah, well, I think a lot of the a lot of my favourites have left now. Are there any of my performances in drama which stand out in your mind that you remember? Um, no. Do the evil face, you told me Do the, the evil face, do the evil face now and I'll remember. Take the cap off. That's it, I remember it. It's a good face, isn't it? It's scary, isn't it? <laughs> it's a bit scary. It is. Yeah. I'm quite proud I taught you that. <laughs> yeah, it took me a long time to <laughs> learn it. They'll get, they'll get bigger. <laughs> 